Narragansett Bay is without question the greatest natural resource that we have here in Rhode Island. Narragansett Bay to me um, is basically adventure. It's an ability to leave my home and in 20 minutes uh, be at a number of different locations where as soon as I dip under the surface, it's a great unknown. You're in an environment that's it's certainly alien, but it's breathtakingly beautiful. To try to capture that and to communicate that to others, that's, that's what I live for. One of the key skills that I acquired through many, many years of spearfishing was the ability to approach fish in an unobtrusive manner. The amount of life in Narragansett Bay is, is staggering. The number of species that inhabit the bay, it's not a clean body of water from the sense of, of visual clarity, but it's a rich broth of all kinds of organisms, and this can sometimes reduce the visibility, but uh, the amount of life uh, here that you can explore uh, in eight to 10 feet of visibility, which is pretty common for the bay, uh, as you get out of the bay, uh, areas like Newport, South County beaches, 15, 20 feet of visibility is, is not uncommon either. Narragansett Bay, is really cleaner now than it's been in 75, maybe even 100 years. I would say to anybody that's had a passing thought about exploring, diving, and getting into it, uh, absolutely, absolutely. You have a resource that's so close by, and um, you don't have to spend a fortune on equipment. Breath hole diving doesn't necessitate a, a huge expenditure, and um, you're gonna have some fabulous times and see some sights that otherwise, how else would you get to see? So um, explore the bay, enjoy the bay, and protect the bay.